what's up this is Renato aka time trip to BMX today I'm going to show you a video on how to make an Instagram edit on your iPhone first I'm going to start out I'm going to use the app called iMovie so first we're going to tap the plus button on the bottom and then we're going to tap movie and then um, the default theme is called simple and I'm just going to hit create I'm doing it in portrait view instead of landscape because it's got more options. So I'm going to hit the media button here and I'm going to go find my video. So this is the video I recorded, pre recorded it yesterday. And here's the first example of the reason why I like using it in portrait mode because this rewind button brings me right to the beginning of the clip that I'm working on. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to scroll into the video to find my beginning point, which is going to be right there. So I'm going to tap the video to highlight it in yellow, and it's giving me my tools on the bottom. I'm going to hit split, and then I'm going to highlight the part that I don't want and delete it. So now I'm going to go back to the video. I'm going to play it and stop it where I want to split it again. Alright, so I'm going to just press the video, hit split. So now it's just got that one clip. So now I'm going to scroll to find my next clip. Alright, that's where it's going to begin. So I'm going to highlight, I'm going to split, I'm going to delete the part that I don't want. Go back to it, let it play, and stop it. With All right, it's going to end right there. I'm going to highlight and split. And now I'm going to continue scrolling to get my next clip. All right. So I'm going to split it right there. I'm going to delete the part I don't want. Go back to the beginning, watch it, stop it. There we go. I'm going to stop it. I'm gonna split it. Now I know there's nothing left in this video that I want, so I'm just going to delete the rest of it. So with my three clips, I got 5.3 seconds that you see on the end there. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to add in the opening logo. So I opened up the media button. It's showing me my videos. On the bottom, you see video, photos, audio. And the photos, I'm going to go to my camera roll and I'm going to grab my Time Drift to BMX logo. And right there, in the, between the two, the, the image and the clip, there's a uh, fade effect. I'm going to break it to nothing because um, if you use any other effect, it'll take time away from the video clip. So I only use them when I'm working on a long video, but this is a short Instagram video. So now I'm going to highlight my logo, and it's giving me these options right on the logo here for the beginning and the end. So I'm going to hit the beginning, and I'm going to position the picture where I want it to be in the beginning. And then I'm going to go to the end, and I'm going to position the picture where I want in the end. And then down here on the bottom, I'm going to hit duplicate. And then I'm going to change that fade again to nothing. And I'm going to take my clip. And I'm going to drag it to the end of the video. And now the, the images, when you add them, it usually makes them by default something like five seconds. So I'm just going to drag. You can make it bigger. I'm going to make it its smallest point on both sides on the beginning and the end clip. So now check the time. It's a six seconds altogether. So I'm going to add audio now. So I'm going to hit my media button. I'm going to go down to audio on the bottom. I'm going to go to songs. I'm going to pick the song that I want, which is this song right here. I'm going to hit the arrow to insert it. Now I'm going to clip the audio. I'm going to snip the audio clip a little. So 
I'm going to kind of cut the audio, so I'm going to highlight the audio, split it, I'm going to delete the beginning part, and then it'll begin where I cut it. Alright, and then on top of that, I'm going to have it fade in and out because since there's no audio behind the logo, it plays it at full speed, and when it hits the, the video part, it plays the uh, the clip at like half volume, where the audio in the video is actually overpowering the, uh, the music, so I kind of try to even it out, and what I'll do is I'll highlight my audio, I'll hit the speaker button, and then I'll... At, it's at 100% volume, so I'm going to change that to, um, that looks good, 173%. And then I'm going to hit this little fade button on the side, and I'm going to have it fade into where the clip starts. And then I'm going to scroll to the end of the video and make sure the audio is highlighted, and I'm going to have it fade out as well. And that should pretty much be my finished product. Let's check it out. <laughs> Alright, so I'm satisfied with that. So now in the upper corner, I'm going to hit the arrow. And if I want, I can change the name of the movie, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to save it right to my computer. It gives me all the options of uploading, but I'm going to save it right to my, um, camp, my phone. I'm going to choose the highest definition. Alright, saves to my phone, so now I'm going to hit my home button, and I'm going to go to the Square Ready app, Square Ready V for videos, it's a free app, it only works if you connect it to the internet when it can show its banners, so it's open, I'm going to hit OK for that, I'm going to go to albums, I'm going to go to my camera roll, I'm going to find the last clip I made, which is this one, and here in Square Ready I can change the color if I want of the border. I'm just going to keep it white because Instagram uh, by default is white background. Since it's less than 15 seconds, it shows this uh, progress bar at the bottom of, of that's where you would cut the video if you did it straight from the video. So now I'm going to hit save. Alright, pops up the ad. I'm going to close the ad and hit OK. Now I can go into Instagram and I can go ahead and add a video if I like. And so on and so forth from there. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, keep on rocking BMX. And that's it. I'm out.